This video will be a discussion of the slide and some facts and taxonomy of caprinus mushrooms, several species on our slides, collectively called inky cap mushrooms. Let's review caprinus taxonomy. It is in the domain eukarya, which means a true membrane-bound nucleus, kingdom fungi, and then we go through division, class, order, family, and genus, caprinus. Remember, genus is always capitalized and in italics. A couple of interesting factoids about this species, the inky cap or caprinus mushrooms. They get their name inky caps from the fact that the gills liquefy into this black inky substance which has been used and can be utilized as an ink. The liquefaction, however, is not designed to be ink. It's designed to aid in dispersing those spores. It causes the cap to peel upward and as the wind blows it positions the spores in the best possible position to catch that wind current to increase the odds of better dispersal. Here is our first slide and in this slide it's using the 4x objective. You can't see a whole lot here. We can see the cap, we can see the gills, and there's several gills here which I have labeled. Further in, which we cannot see at this magnification, is the stalk. Now here is the same slide, only we've increased magnification. We are now utilizing the 10x objective. We can see the cap here, and we can see these gills a little closer, and now we can actually see a few spores along these gills. When we get a little higher, we should be able to see the gills and the hypha. Now here is a different slide using the 4x objective. This slide has faded over time, but I selected it because we can actually see the cap, the stalk, and the gills, and you can even see at 4x a few of these little fuzzy spots. Those are actually spores. Here is that same slide which I have been able to enhance with the computer a little bit to where we can get a closer look of the stalk but we can see the gills here and we can see a lot of spores I've labeled a couple spores here of this caprinus this slide using the 40x objective again it's been computer enhanced somewhat but I brought it even a little closer in so we could see some spores coming off of these gills here is another slide using the 40x objective in which we can see an edge of the cap. So we can see, remember, the mushrooms are made up not of cellulose, but of chitin, which is a carbohydrate that is similar to the chitin found in animals such as shrimp, lobsters, arthropods. And here is the last view of a slide we're going to look at. It's using the 40x objective. It's a very close-up shot of a gill. And we can see lots of spores. And we can see hypha. Hypha are the main mode of vegetative growth in mushrooms. And together, collectively, hypha are referred to as mycelium. And this wraps up my discussion of caprinus.